the video title will be how not to take the self portrait on film. Stay. Hi. So, thank you. First of all, thank you for checking out this video. I've been wanting to do this video for a long, long time. So today, I want to do a cool self-portrait comparison. I've been doing self-portraits in the past few months. Since we're all locked up in our rooms, i starting to experiment self-portrait on film, which hasn't been the easiest thing, but I enjoyed it a lot. So what I have with me today, I actually have a lot of camera with me. 500 cm Hasselblad, Nikon F3, and of course Polaroid SX70. The film stock I have today, Lomography 400, Fuji 400 Pro, and of course Polaroid. Let's do this. So I am at a garden in North Jersey. Where should I go? Anywhere with less people because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna embarrass myself. So I only have this tripod for the phone. It's just only because it's small and it's portable. Um, the tripod has decided to become a dual pot. Yeah, one leg broke. <laughs> it's going so good so far. This is what I usually do. I will check in the viewfinder from the ground glass to see if I like the space before I jump into it. I think this might be a good location. Be probably hiding in a bush somewhere change of plan so when I take a video from the viewfinder what I would do is to screenshot the pose that I like usually when I'm posing I actually don't remember what I post uh, and this a video helped me to recall that pose and in order to recreate I do like this shot something along this I do like when I am facing down this. How you do a self-timer on Hasselblad is to put a setting on Z and when you click the shutter, it will give you about 7 seconds to take the picture. Okay. <gasps> You're just getting to see how I really work behind the scene. Clumsy. moment of truth. I'm moving the sun real quick. something that doesn't look like I'm just taking a selfie but it's quite hard without using a timer Ooh, this is not bad it doesn't really show much of the grass that I was hoping for hey but it will work I'm going to change the back i'm gonna use this manual back so i actually didn't know that hasselblad back it has manual model and automatic model i thought that the a12 was just a manual because you have to do everything but it turns out that a stands for automatic <sighs> this is stressful let's try to get focus right Put the camera onto V. It was moving. Okay. Do you think I should try to shoot at f 2.8? I don't have confidence. I, I think it's going to be way out of focus. But then again, that's kind of cool. I'm using the Hasselblad as <laughs> a stand. Great. This is a mess. I don't care anymore. It is what it is. Okay, second shot. 
What do I do with you? Well, I don't know. I'm hungry. I'm tired. Before I head back, just want to take one more shot of porridge because I just checked. This is a failure. <laughs> the porridge didn't go come out that well. Um, so I just want to do one more so I can redeem myself. So this is what I had to go through to take self portraits. Even just with like a digital camera, taking self portrait isn't easy. Um, and it's a film camera, so there's just extra steps that you have to do. I always want to say this thing, so please like, comment, subscribe to the channel. <laughs> Me and my friends has a lot coming up. We have a lot to offer. I'm probably the least qualified film photographer among all the friends. I'm constantly learning. Join me on this learning journey. Ooh, you know what? We should take an ending Polaroid shot. Yeah, this counts as a selfie too. Thank <laughs> you.